finally remember to hit the recording button. I feel like I feel like I should have had the rant in the recording there about about the Skittles and the Lemonheads. Long story short, to be really confusing to anyone that watches this on YouTube or skips ahead in the VOD, uh, Lemonheads and Sour Skittles, the inside of them sucks, man. It is what's on the outside that counts. So these people are aired the fuck out. Oh shit, um, that's right. We had this thing going on up here. I forgot all about that. Do we try one more time <laughs> to see if we can trigger that before these people leave us? Who's our fastest person? Uh, health. Moving 100%, 80%, 57%. Oh, you got gut worms and you're pregnant and you're stoned. Okay, I mean, yeah, I guess that's a good reason. Uh, Chocobo, 96. 96, 100, and what's a Lulu got? 100. Did we send the child? I'm not going to send the child. Looks like it's probably going to be Rue. Because Rue is the only person that's not basically stoned or uh, <laughs> missing body parts or anything. So uh, just draft Rue real quick. Get them to come up here. My goal here is to trigger them, make them angry before these people leave, which sadly they're already doing. See, it's not gonna work. It's not gonna fucking work. Okay, so change of plans, I guess. Grab everyone. Try to do this in a smart way instead, I suppose. Uh, hmm. So we have the ability to spew fire, which I mean, is a thing. Does everybody? Everybody that doesn't have a gun, do you suck with a gun? Is that the problem? You have a shooting skill of five. You're a stronger meleeer, but you have a shooting skill of zero. Rue also has a shooting skill of zero. So, Chocobo, do we have another gun? We have a shitty bow. Like, <laughs> Rue's ready to sleep in. I don't work till noon tomorrow. Dude, hell yeah, Rue. It's actually really exciting for you, my guy. I uh, hope you have a wonderful night's rest. I was just taking a nap before the stream. That's why I was like 10 minutes late because <laughs> Noodle didn't wake me up until... Well, actually, I woke myself up, but I'm not mad at Noodle. I, they let me sleep in a, a little bit. Like, I'm not upset about that. <laughs> that is perfectly acceptable. Uh, but yeah, no. I sadly don't think that's actually the best option. How the fuck are we going to deal with these things? Okay. You have a mini shotgun. That's not that bad. You have a charge lance. Fires a single shot high velocity. Uh huh. You also have a mini shotgun. You have no weapon. You're just a scyther or whatever. Yeah, a scyther. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, we breathe? We breathe, boys. What do we got this time? Anything interesting? Oh, actually, it doesn't look that different. <laughs> Wait, didn't we have one that looked very similar to this not too long ago? I admit, I kind of forget what Bo looked like before, but colors are much better now. Yeah, I think it's pretty decent. Uh, oh man, what we need is like some EMP grenades or something. We're all going to die. Okay, let's get you guys just like, you have like a proximity activator or something. Uh, Actually, you know what? Okay, here's what we can do. Can we make turrets? Probably not. I guess our best bet is actually to wait until the walls are finished. Um, what I'm gonna do is do we have we have a decent amount of food so i'm gonna take everybody's construction which right now is on five except for optijack who's on a four i need to remember that terrible people nine and then five and then four nine five four final fantasy ten also hello hello <laughs> all right so nine for bad people five and then four putting everybody on a level one construct 
Um, okay, you guys are eating meals. That's fine. We need to finish building these walls. I think that's actually our best bet of dealing with these things. Yeah, there's going to be some failed construction. We're going to waste some materials. That's fine. I accept this. It's going to have to be what it be. Um... But if we get these walls all built, then hopefully we can take care of these these bros without getting murdered like we did last time. I need you guys to hope with me to... What happened? I'm mad boomalope. Bruh, come on. I'm trying to do something here. I uh, need you guys to hope with me no fishy death. Your sister's blood parrot? I didn't even know that was a kind of parrot that we've been taking care of. Uh, is white as a ghost, and we have no idea why. We got him goldfish friends, and you had to move them temporarily to your 10-gallon, which is not an ideal size to see if he's stressed from them. I mean, I, I admit, I don't know a ton about fish, but I don't think just moving them into an oversized tank would harm them, right? Feel free to correct me if I'm wrong on that, of course. Because, again, not a fishy expert. But I don't think that'll harm them. At the very least, I do definitely hope it will harm them. Where's this mad boomalope? Does anybody see? Ah, oh, there it is. Red. You. Get got. Okay, you're gonna come around somewhere? I actually don't know. Just get everyone together. I'd prefer to kill it outside of our base. Are you gonna cross the water? No. Okay. Everybody just like, I guess we don't need the cover really, but I'm really hoping we can take it out before it gets too close. Good. Uh, keep. Okay, you, 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 excuse me, you and I guess Lulu too can be undrafted. And then the gun wielders here keep attacking that. Nate, that's a terrible spot to eat your meal, dude. <laughs> Why would you stand there of all places to eat your fucking meal, my guy? <laughs> like, just the bullets whizzing past your head, like. <sighs> Is parrotfish be swimming weird or not using pectoral? <laughs> what? Parrotfishy swimming? I I don't even know what that means, but I would definitely say that's weird. <laughs> How was that frozen? It was literally on fire. It burned away to nothing, yet somehow it was still frozen. That's how you know it's too fucking cold outside, dude. Like, oh, also, um, I realized, so I thought the mod, the stack size mod was messed up or whatever, because it wasn't working before, um, or it wasn't changing the stack size. It turns out it doesn't update until you restart the game. So it should be working now, hopefully. Um, but that's why before it, like, yeah, it was kind of shit. Uh, but I did, like, recheck all the files and everything. Hopefully, there will be no more, like, error people coming onto the map at this point. Nate needs medical treatment? Um, okay. Tell you what. If you lay down at some point, Nate, I'll make Noodle... There we go. Or, actually, I think Otto's also a doctor. So Otto can take care of you. Because we do want to get rid of Nate's stomach parasites or whatever at some point. Oh my god, what happened? We got a zit. Uh, everybody draft, undraft, take care of the fires. Thank you. And then get back to doing what you were doing. We get our classroom set up and stuff we did. Good, good, good. Huh. He's kind of staying in one place, actually, like in one of the corners of his 75-gallon tank and hasn't moved or eaten for two days now. Oh, so parrotfish are... Wait, blood parrots are fish. See, I didn't, I didn't even know that was a fish, dude. I thought blood parrots were just like a red parrot or something. <laughs> Told you, no expert on fish. Not even a little bit, my guy. <laughs> Oh, God. Send a pic in Discord. Take a look. Okay. Uh, not that Discord. This Discord. Boop, boop. General. Oh. 
<laughs> he looks so chubby. I'm assuming that's just what they're meant to look like, but... Oh, good. Nate and Chocobo got the plague. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Why? Ah, uh, okay. Bed rest. Chocobo. Level one. Nate. Nate was already on level one. Son of a bitch, dude. They chonks? Yeah. <laughs> I can see that. <laughs> but no, I, I do hope he gets better, though, my guy. Alright, do you guys need treated? Yes. Alright, Noodle. What are you doing? You're washing. Stop washing yourself and take care of other people. I'm guessing Nate was already, yeah. Neg's got fucking gut worms, is pregnant, and has the plague. So, things are going well for Nate. Uh, immunity is outpacing, at least in Chocobo, outpacing the plague. It is in Nate, too. So, as long as they stay in bed and keep getting treatment, they should be fine. Yes, Nate's pregnant, having a child. Optijack is very, very slowly <laughs> building some traps. I think his skill is pretty low, right? Um, happy youngster. Oh, wait. I'm in the wrong fucking tab. Can you tell I'm still half asleep? Construction 7. That's not that bad, actually. Oh, we're going to run out of wood, dude. Oh, we got 1127. We still have a decent bit. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Ba -da -da. Also, a trick that I've seen, which we probably don't have to do, uh, but to help people be, like, attracted to a certain area, uh, they need a lot of wealth in that area. Um, so, like, this here would probably be enough to, to attract enemies to the inside of our base. Instead of, like, breaking through walls, but coming through the technically open path. Um, hopefully, though, by opening these doors, they'll be attracted to all this wealth as well. And, like, yeah. That's the hope, at least. Chocobo is very unhappy. Psychite withdrawal. Why won't somebody give this man Psychite? Okay. Can I, like, force you to drink Psychite? <laughs> you're in serious pain. You're hungry. You're sick. Yeah, these are all valid. Uh, okay. Prioritize tending to Nate. And then feed Chocobo. And Otto. Uh, you're teaching a lesson? Yeah, that's fine, I guess. Wait. Nate, what are you doing? Oh, god damn it! The errors are still popping up, dude. How are we supposed to treat you if you don't... Oh, you all suck. Nate, rest until heal, dude. You have the plague. All right, is Noodle like... Okay, you're still feeding Chocobo at least. So after you're done feeding Chocobo, take care of Nate. You're going to go organize. You don't want to take care of people. So you want your friends to die? Bruh. We lost all of our battery power, which sucks. Whenever that zit happened. Okay, how's your plague? 71. Your plague is 78. Okay. So you two should be fine. Oh, wait, are we out of Psychite? Uh, we must be out of Psychite, dude. So everybody's going to be in pissy mood. We have some leaves. I hate everything. <laughs> Trust me, tomorrow you're going to do a 50% water change. You're also going to see if you can get him a sponge filter. Ooh. Deep graven his sub substrate. I don't know what that means, but I'm assuming it's a good thing. Plague Major, you're about to be healed. Chocobo's getting up now. Whatever. I'm done. Uh, yours is a little bit lower, but again, you should be fine. They both should be fine at this point. 
Colonist needs rescue. Chocobo. Well, that lasted a long time. <laughs> Plague extreme. There you go. You're fine now. You're immune. Um. Okay, so... Nate can come off of bed rest, so can Chocobo. Okay. Because Nate should be developing immunity any second now, too. Yep, there it goes. Alright. Both immune to the plague for the time being. Wild Boar has started to roam away. That's fine. I don't care. He can leave. Dude, we're already down to 10 meals. Okay. I take it back. <laughs> Nate... You're not allowed to be on a level 1 construct. Why is Chocobo out now? What's wrong with you now? I thought you were fine. I mean, you're a little malnourished, but... Oh, is it because of the Psychite withdrawal? Man, I don't know. Anyways, whatever. Nate. Wait, somebody just disappeared? I'm so confused, dude. Cooking, or no, not cooking. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Construction. Five. All right, Nate, what are you doing? Consuming simple meal. Okay, as soon as you're done with that, please go make something. <laughs> Anything. <laughs> Just holy hell. You're washing yourself now? Why are you going all the way up there? Dude, this one's closer. <laughs> Wash yourself with that one. It's not polluted. Uh. What? What's with the... What's with the... Okay. Don't know what's going on there. I'm just going to pretend it doesn't exist and move on. <laughs> we need to get better power, man, at some point. All right, Nate, we have, like, no meals. How tired are you? You've had enough sleep. Um, prioritize cooking. We need food, and we need a fast. Nate's starving. Nate, you'll be fine. Cook some damn food. We have the food, it's just raw. Thankfully, it's cold enough outside that our freezer's still frozen. That's handy. Alright, speed up the game. Maybe that's the pollution starting to spread. Oh good, sad wonder. From Psychite Withdraw. Imagine that! Everybody's addicted to Psychite. And Nate's on a food binge. Nate's in... Or Chocobo's in a daze. Things are going well, my guys. Where's the fucking Psychite? <laughs> this is Haygrass Psychoid. There it is. Put this one on critical priority. It's too cold right now to grow it, but for fuck's sake... You know what? We should probably start another field of Psychoid, too. Just to make sure this doesn't continue to happen. Cotton, potato, strawberry, corn. Here we go. This small corn one, congratulations. You are now also going to be psychoid. Our chickens are probably about to starve too, but it'll be fine. Rue's throwing a tantrum. Things are going really well around here. Um, in case that wasn't clear. Uh, that's disturbing, but okay. Uh, refill. 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 Why are you angry? Uh, it's a good question. I think it's because you don't have your tea. Yeah. <laughs> it's because you don't have any of your tea that you're addicted to. That everybody's addicted to. Addicted. Addicted. Oh, no, Nate's not addicted. Chocobo's addicted. Optijack's addicted. Otto's addicted. Lulu is addicted. <laughs> Literally everybody except for Nate is addicted to this tea. And we're out of it. 
<laughs> we have very little. Oh, there goes Lulu. Lulu's now on a sad wander. Ah, uh, who's the dad of Nate's baby? That's a good question. The dad of Nate's baby is... Well, that's weird. <laughs> did, did you fuck that up? Or did, did it just die? Fucking Twitch emotes. How do I see the baby? Heck, you streamlabs. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, streamlabs screwed it up either way, but for some reason, like, the emotes aren't showing up anyways. Okay, pregnant. Father's auto. Hungry pen animals, animal starvation. Yeah, I figured that was going to happen. Because we need to build this bigger chunk of pen here. Uh, allow. In the meantime, though, deconstruct. Bro, there's so many eggs. There's so many eggs. My mod that's supposed to make these regular, like unfertilized, whenever they're ruined, isn't working, and that bothers me. Bulk good trader. Are they still broken too? They are. Look at that. Just all aired the fuck out. Do you guys have, like, actual weapons by any chance? No. Shitty bows and pikes. Hmm. It is auto, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Right, pretty much all of you should be set to... Hauling wood to wall. When you're done with that, give the, give the animals some feed. Chocobo's done picking out on food. That's good. The wall is almost done. Once the wall is done, everything can go back to being normal. <sighs> Object failed while constructing wooden spike trap. Good. Object failed while constructing wooden spike trap. I think Optijack just shouldn't be allowed to construct wooden spike traps, dude. <laughs> Holy hell. Has it just not been... Oh. Bro, I'm a freaking idiot. I built those walls right in the path of the freaking thing here. There we go. Shouldn't be blocked by anything now. Or this one. Objects in a daze. Oh my god, everything's so bad. Everything was going so smoothly, man. And then I had to screw it up. Yeah, okay, that's the pollution that's spreading. I must have turned on the pollution map at some point. Hmm. Okay, well, our food's coming back. That's good, at least. Just gotta wait for things to progress. Should Psychite T be above meals? It would help a lot with people's moods, to be honest. Screw it, whatever. What's Nate doing anyways? Consuming food. Chocobo's hiding in a room. Mr. Noodle's in a daze. I mean, they're halfway through. Or not halfway, like a quarter of the way through their withdrawal, which, I mean, is something. We really need, like, a nice, strong windstorm so we can generate some more power. This one still seems to be getting less power. I don't think the bridges would block it, right? I don't think... Oh, there's some trees over here. Yeah, that'll do it, too. It's probably not getting done because of... Uh, the manager thing's not being done. 
Alright, this is done now, so I can select similar, all of this, deconstruct. That will give us a little bit of wood back and give them a little bit more room to, to roam around to collect food. I don't think it'll get us above their base consumption, but it'll at least get us closer. You were talking to your grandma since the blood parrot is her favorite fish. You were updating her on what we need tomorrow. Who's the dad? Is it Otto? Yes. Yes, it is. It's Otto. Otto is the father. Your noodles and another doll. Psychic addictions down or up to 30% though. Uh, once it hits 100, they are no longer addicted. The thing is, like, Psychite's one of the few drugs in the game that's actually beneficial. Um, like, it doesn't have any real downside. Except for whenever this happens. <laughs> we just gotta make sure to keep enough of it r around that... Withdraw doesn't happen. Do we not have any... Ingredients for tea? Is that the problem? Don't we just need psychoid? Oh, it's probably because I only have the bulk one turned on. I mean, it's not going to matter. There's not going to be enough to, like, fix everyone. So, I guess it doesn't really matter if we make it or not. You increase the filter flow for Lucifer to make sure he's getting enough surface agitation, which gives him air. And two, guess what you did today? There's two answers. Stupid thing I did and the cool thing I did. I mean, it could have been anything. <laughs> uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> I have no clue. What'd you do, man? All right. What's your food at now? Ooh, nu nutrition growth 8.2. Okay. So it should, in theory, be self-sustaining now, uh, food-wise. We'll still have to take care of the water problem. But, like... Wait, is the wall done? The mechanoid cluster has landed not far from Olympia. There's a psychic drone or machine there tuned to the female gender, and there's a mech cluster. The mech cluster will remain until you send a team to attack and destroy it. Why? <laughs> now all the females are going to be in shitty-ass moods, dude. All right, how is everyone's mood right now? Bad really bad. <laughs> Nate's, Nate's fine. <laughs> Chocobo shitty. Optijack shitty. Otto's okay. And Lulu's pretty shit. Good stuff. Uh, well, the one thing we can do that will help a little bit is we can reset the construction priorities. Five, five, five. You don't construct. Where's Nate? You're four. And then nine, nine, nine. Should at least help things get done a little bit. Chocobo's in a date. Good. Good. Rue filled petition for name change. Finally, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Stupid. Rue and their team totally missed the fact that we had a presentation today because we were so focused on the project. We were un dressed business was required and we had a bare bones presentation our only saving grace was that we knew all of our shit and didn't even look at the slides except to see what we were needing to talk about i'm sorry bro <laughs> that does suck <laughs> i mean at least you guys kind of saved it right but yeah that's that's rough <laughs> all right um Allow that to be built. I don't know why I have that not being built. In fact, what I should do... I should have built that one here, I feel like. Yeah, whatever.
build it like that, which will make them like zigzag around it. The uh, or make them walk through the things because I, I think by default enemies won't walk over like fences if there's an easier way around, whereas like colonists will. So in theory, by putting the fences like that, they should, yeah, they should like walk into every trap basically. It's kind of a cheaty way of doing things, but whatever. And if I remember correctly, it won't let us build, yeah, ones that are too close to each other anymore. So you used to be able to do like big long lines of them, I thought, but uh, what do I know? Once Chocobo comes out of a daze, I think we're going to start this fight and see how it goes. Holy hell, dude. Cut. 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 <laughs> cut all the plants, please. Don't I have, like, the manager station set to automatically do that? Is it just not being done? Clear wind turbines, yeah. No, clear areas. Wind turbine cells. Of all plants, basically. No, just anything that blocks wind. I don't care about the other stuff. Maybe it wasn't being done because, I don't know. I think Optijack's the main one that does it. Maybe he's too busy doing something else. Maybe the wind turbines are just broke. I don't fucking know. Stream break risk. Optijack. Speaking of, what's your problem? Is it Psychite withdrawal? Yeah, surprise, surprise. Hmm. Manipulation 20 because of Psychite withdrawal? Oh, and you're missing an arm. Yeah. I mean, missing the arm part's pretty legit. Tell you what, to get everybody's moods up, or try to get everybody's moods up, it's gonna instantly, like, renew everybody's addiction. But I'm gonna go ahead and put a bill in for a single thing of Psychite T. Because uh, we need to do this fight, and it's gonna be a lot easier to do the fight if everybody's not in a shitty-ass mood. We can only make three. But, guess it is what it is. Um, yeah, that's honestly just like two per person if we don't have enough to make a group. Just make sure we have at least that many around. There we go. Nate, consuming fine meal. Okay. When you're done with that, cook some food. Or more likely, make some psychite tea. Hopefully nobody, like, hoards it. <laughs> Who's going to get the last one? Chocobo, okay. So now hopefully a couple people... You're still pissy. You're still pissy and pregnant. Uh, Chocobo should no longer be pissy. Yeah, no, you're good now. Optijack is good. And auto. So those are the three that got it. All right, now we got to wait for Noodle to get out of their shitty mood, though. And then we got to try to deal with this other cluster of Mecha Knights. And this one's going to be a lot harder because they're off the map. So we can't, like, build defenses to try to deal with them in a smart way. We're fucked, dude. <laughs> We're so screwed. What just happened? Why did all these chicks just hatch out here, man? <laughs> like, they didn't, what? They didn't even hatch like inside. I am so confused. Where did all these chicks come from? Did they all get, like, reset and break out or something? It's fine. Otto's taking them all back inside. <laughs> that was so weird, man. 
Noodle, how long are you going to be in a shitty mood for, dude? When you're done with that, you're going to need to sleep. Lulu's in a major big risk. Oh my god. So oh, dumb. <laughs> this is so freaking dumb. Alright, uh... There should be enough nutrition now that they don't need to be fed manually. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, block off the food stores again. Wait, I thought I made the psychoid... Did I make the wrong one critical priority? Or no, I just made this little patch critical, didn't I? I don't want all of them. I just want the little one. Yeah. Do I make this one critical too? I guess I do. Let's make sure we have freaking psychoid, man. Noodle is still sad wandering, man. Maybe they'll eat this dead body over here. The camel grunt. Ah, oh, look at that. Power. Maximum power. Hopefully our batteries are recharging. Yes, looks like they are. Oh, that's our psychoid. What was I clicking over here? Smoke leaf. Close enough. Which I think we do have... Oh, no, we don't have the make wart thing. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. So I want to make ten. Uh, I don't know how the with surplus thing works. Details? Currently have 32 out of five. No, you know what? Just do, do until you have ten. Pause when satisfied until you have uh, four. Yeah. So that'll give us enough for two batches, and then as soon as we have don't have enough to make one batch, make uh make another set. All the way up to ten again. That should work. Okay. We can start getting some booze, another thing for everyone to get addicted to. Oh my god, noodle still? You're gonna starve to death, my guy. Oh no. Apparently you got food while you were sad wandering. Don't worry, the sad wander won't stop you from eating. Or sleeping, apparently. <laughs> or making love? <laughs> I don't I'm confused. <laughs> oh. Well, at least the segs is making you a little bit happier. The psychic withdrawal is so tough, man. And this stuff takes forever to grow. 74%. It's getting there. How much do we get from each plant? Guess it doesn't really say like a yield, does it? No, not really. Leave me alone, what a pervert. <laughs> Look, it's not my fault. Y'all are doing it right there for everyone to see. All right, Noodle's still tired, but it's time. Recruit. Get everyone lined up over here. And then... Uh, get Chocobo, you're a meleeer. So you come over here. Nate, you're a meleeer. And Rue, you're a meleeer. Actually, you know what? Come down a little bit more like central over here. Perfect. Lulu, I want you to be, like, in the middle. Because I want you to be able to run away more easily. Everybody else, I guess, is fine. Now, who's got the best movement at the moment? Um, 
75% movement, 46% movement, 86%, 57%, 50%, 50%, 50%, 50%, 60%, 60%, 60%, everyone's slow as shit. So basically whoever I send is probably gonna die, which means it's gotta be Auto, man. <laughs> Auto's one of the gun users though. 75, 46, 86. Okay, Nate's the next best. <laughs> Pregnant ass Nate. Okay, I think it's gotta be Nate, man. Um, save. Uh, yeah, whatever, just save, I don't care what it's called. All right, Nate, Godspeed. And then as soon as you attack, can I like get you to come over here? Run, run, run now. Nate, run. Run, Nate. Nate, run. <laughs> oh God. Why are you slowing down? Just run. Oh God, he was shot. Keep running, keep running, keep running. Oh, that was almost bad. Nate, my guy. Oh no, Nate's down. He got a headshot. Will they leave him alone at least? Death in three hours though. Uh, oh God, they're not even chasing us down. Optijack has a corpse obsession. Okay, I don't plan on like save scumming this, but... Can somebody save Nate? Auto, rescue. Death in two hours. Oh my god. Oh, jaw shattered. Left eye cut out, right ear cut off. Bruh. Oh god, they're still out here. Oh god. So it's gonna have to be a gun user. All right, hold on. This is learning. That's what this is. This is this is us learning. How do we get them to actually come into our base? Uh, I guess it's got to be auto. Uh, you're just out of range. Come up a little bit farther. To like here. Optijack's on an insulting spree. Good. Come on, dude. Hit him. Bruh. They're not going to wake up if you don't hit them. Why do you suck at this so much? What if we shoot the ship? This is literally can't hit the broad... Okay. So this is like literally can't hit the broad side of a barn here, dude. Otto, you really need to run faster than that, my guy. Seriously? Otto, dude, come on. Bruh. What, what are we gonna do? Uh, and they don't like chase us down. We need, like, mortars is what we need. I guess that's the next option. Try to figure out how to make mortars. Okay. Uh, everybody, go do whatever you want to do. Um, security. Okay, so we don't have the research for it. Mortar, 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 mortar. Auto doors. Improvise explosives. Toxifier generator. Smithing, harp, double strand, drugs, cocoa. Uh, machining. Gunsmithing. Mortars. That's 7,000 research.
and we need to research smithing first. Seven, so that's 8,050 research. That will take literally forever. How quickly does this pollution spread? I mean, Rue's researching their little heart out. I just realized Chocobo doesn't even have their weapon. This run might end sooner than I thought it was going to, man. Uh, so as that pollution spreads, that's really going to screw us, man. Not to mention the fact that everybody, every female is pissed the hell off right now because of another group of mechs. You ever heard that TikTok sound? His ear was cut off, his arm was cut off, his leg was cut off, his tongue was cut out? No, I've definitely never heard that. We're a poor Lulu. I like this colony. I don't want this colony to die. But without just, like, cheating... Like, I don't... I don't know what to do. Because, I mean, there's always this. Like, where is it? Somewhere in here. Gameplay? My graphics general? Oh, not the debug log. Do do tweak values menu. You can tell I like never use this menu. I know of it, but I've literally never used it before. We could turn on God mode. <laughs> Sound test restart. There should be a way to like spawn stuff. Nate, what's up, my guy? Oh. Spawn thing. Turret auto mortar? Uh. Wait, is that its... Minimum range 30, okay. Do we need to give it... <laughs> Do we need to give it anything? <laughs> Does it automatically start firing? <laughs> I, we probably have to piss them off first to get them to do anything. How did I get into that menu? Was it this one? Yeah. Uh, actions. Spawn thing. Uh, Inferno, auto mortar, mini turret mortar, minified. Okay, and then what? We just have to install these. Can I? Oh, it was under a roof. Mr. Noodle starved out of their pregnancy. That's good. I'm gonna respawn. I just wanna, just wanna see if this is even gonna work, or reload, I guess. Uh, and then. We need to spawn, uh, what are they? Are they called mortars? Cool. Spawn, cool thing stack, I guess. Fuel generator mortar, what are they called? Can't even think of what they're called. There's so many freaking things, man. Weapons, maybe. No. Uranium. Ah, oh, shells. That's what they are. Uh, high explosive shells. 
And you know, I think you need barrels too. Reinforced barrel. Uh, Optijack. Get to it, my guy. I'm you complain about us constantly? What? How does I'm you complain about us constantly? Doesn't even make sense. What? Oh, because I... Do it now. <laughs> and then, child. Man the golden mortar. Auto. Man a golden mortar. And, uh, Nate. No, not Nate. Rue. Man the uranium mortar. Will you guys automatically fire, or do I need to, like, give you a target? Guess I probably need to give you a target, huh? Set target. Uh this. There we go. <laughs> that worked. Now will the auto turrets start firing now? You don't know what ha I don't know what happened. Auto's in a daze. God damn it, Auto. You're supposed to be running a Nate. Right, I'm running a Nate. <laughs> running a turret. Uh, who's not in a daze? Optijack. Man the gold mortar. Are we even hitting the thing? Barely. <laughs> Our aim is so shit. Oh my god, you guys suck. Is the auto turret? Okay, yeah, the auto turret looks like it is firing. The auto mortar. So, I mean, I guess this would technically work. So, I get that that's gonna be what we have to do, but I don't even know, like, how we go about making this. Because the barrels, as far as I'm aware, the only way to get the barrels is to trade for them. Which, I mean, is something that we can technically do, right? Like... Lulu's gone berserk. Oh, God. <laughs> God, we're shooting the child. <laughs> Bruh, Lulu! Mr. Noodle's the one shooting her. Oh, God. Noodle, save your child! Oh, no. Oh, God. Well, whatever. All right. We know, we know what to do. We have to try to rush the mortars. Honestly, I guess just one would be fine. Like, building one would be fine. Because they don't seem to attack. So as long as we make sure no one ever goes over there, like, we should be okay. Uh, the only thing that we have to worry about is if we can get to mortar tech before pollution gets to us. Now, it expands at a constant rate of four tiles a day, I guess, or four cells, whatever you want to call it. Um, so the bigger the, the ex around it is, the longer it's going to take for it to expand out. So we might be able to make it in time. And I'm assuming it has some sort of, like, maximum. Um, maybe? I don't know. There's a fire that literally nobody's taking care of. There we go. Object finally went and took care of it. Oh, I need to turn off dev menu. Oh, good. Object's throwing a tantrum. Things are going well, guys. At least his tantrum didn't last long. Um... I think we're fucked. Nobody said Noodle was a bad mother. Chick Nye is burned to death? Oh, dude, there's more fires over here. I guess we don't have that area home zoned. 
Yeah, we don't. <laughs> Oops. As much as I hate doing this because, like, cleaning is a bitch, just mark all of this as home zone. Really need to kill a couple of these chicks and turkeys and stuff. I think that's Otto's job. They're too busy relaxing socially, apparently, to murder our pets. Oh, good, more fire. I love how everybody knows that our base is on fire, but everybody's just like, oh, I'm too busy watching the clouds or having a chat or <laughs> whatever, you know? <laughs> like, it's fine. We don't care that everything we own is burning down. <laughs> Why does that matter? Very important message. Melanie Martinez's new album drops 331. It looks like it's gonna be so good. Or so good. Wait. Why are these plants dying? I thought the pollution was just the red area. Toggle zones, learning helper. Toggle roost, fertility overlay. Okay, it's not the fertility overlay. Home zones. Is it this one? That's temperature. Pollution. You know, it looks a lot like these plants are dying over here. This might just be the end of the fucking colony, dude. <laughs> That's a real possibility right now. Well, how's the poll doing? <laughs> we, we might need to figure out what uh, what we're gonna start playing next. Straw poll. If you haven't got your votes in, I guess now's the time. Uh, your results. Western RPGs, Fallout and Elder Scrolls is winning by one at the moment. So, uh, <laughs> might end up having to do that soon. I don't know. God damn it, dude. This was supposed to be a mostly chill run, you know? Uh, Lulu has a corpse obsession, so they're going to dig up some corpses and just throw them around places because, you know, that's normal. Uh, looks like, where are you taking and the corpse? To our or to our dinner table? Yep. Oh, just dug up a dead child, actually, and uh, threw it on the table. That's fine. Somebody get that the hell out of here, please. Oh, Oxjack's eating on top of the dead child. <laughs> Bruh. Oh, this was supposed to be an easy run. Why? <laughs> oh. Bruh. All I wanted to do was get to build some robots, have a happy little colony, See what some of the end game tech is like, because I figured, you know what, that should be kind of fun, right? Cool, we've we learned how to make microelectronics. So now we need to learn how to make mortars. Which needs gunsmithing, which needs machining, which needs smithing. Research. Oh. I can't tell if everything's dead because of fire or because that pollution actually has spread a lot farther than it shows here. 
I'm assuming that it's spread a lot farther than it shows here, sadly. Which means that it's already reaching our base. Specifically where we have our corn planted. It's only a matter of time until other stuff starts to get fucked. As far as I know, there's no way for us to stop the pollution besides destroying that thing. And sending our people up there to do that seems like a death wish. Yeah, see, it, it, it's slowly killing everything in our base, dude. So, waiting for mortars isn't going to work. This might be the end of the colony, guys. Or at least pretty damn close to it. Alright, um... Guns are most effective at close range. Honestly... The shotgunners are probably the most dangerous things. Lulu? I mean, I really don't want the child to be over here, but put the Lulu back here. Optijack. Stand next to Otto. Nate, you're... Okay, you're not range. Who are we missing? One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're missing Mr. Noodle. Feeling depressed. Why are you not drafted? Mr. Noodle cannot walk? Okay. To make matters worse, I guess we're doing this without Mr. Noodle. It's currently throwing up. Come on, get the scyther down, please. Brad's three on one. Okay, get this, dude. Come on, pull aggro. God, Nate's so slow. Oh, dude, he's dead. Okay, come get this one. This went... A hundred times better than I could have hoped. Bruh, that... That worked. <laughs> okay, who's not in a really shitty mood? Is there anybody that's not? Otto, how bad are you? Death in seven hours, you're gonna be okay. Optijack, you're fine. Chocobo, death in 16. Rue, you're fine, just bruised. Oh my god, dude, we're alive. Um... Wow, okay. Uh, I'm legitimately, legitimately surprised right now. How are the chicks getting out again? Why do chicks keep spawning outside of the... F Something's broken, dude. <laughs> I bet it's like a giant thing of them all hatching at the same time. Anyways, yeah, the, the poison is reaching our plants. Um, so, Nate. Okay, hold on. Did you guys make it to bed yet? More or less. Okay, you're slowly getting better. Otto didn't make it to bed. So, Nate... Actually, Rue, you're just bruised. Rescue Otto. Why'd you take him there? Of all places. Oh, he got shot in the heart, dude. <laughs> He's lucky to be alive, honestly. But okay. Wasn't somebody else pretty roughed up? Optijack. Uh, you have a hemogen craving. I honestly didn't know that was a thing. Like, he has to have blood. Can we, like... Oh, you're, like, wandering or something, aren't you? I don't know. You're under catharsis. Can we, like... 
So if we take someone healthy, you're in your third trimester. Like Lulu. Operations, add bill. Extract hemogen pack information. Extract a hemogen pack from the target. The operation will fail to produce a hemogen pack if the target does not have enough blood. Success rate 100%. Death chance on fail 0%. Okay. So... Wait, where is it? Extract hemogen pack. Noodle is just sleeping their, their life away. Uh, somebody needs to feed them. Rue? Prioritize feeding Mr. Noodle before they starve and lose the baby. Or wait, no, they already left, lost the baby. That's probably why they're depressed. Or no, pregnant, third trimester. What? I'm so confused. Chocobo starving. Well, look. It's kind of hard when both of our doctors are down. Feed Chocobo. Who's got a medical emergency? Chocobo and auto? I thought you were fine. You're fine. You're both fine. You just lost some blood. You're going to be okay. Advanced starvation? Well, you're not... You are still starved, Noodle? Holy shit. You literally just ate. Beat Chocobo again. Or not Chocobo. Noodle again. Crap, you get hungry quick, Noodle. Cotton plant has died because of poison. Yeah, about that. Okay, Lulu. Oh, you're not allowed to go out there. That's fair. Optijack, when you're done consuming that fine meal, we got a job for you. How long does it take you to eat? There we go. Melee attack ship. How you doing, Noodle? Some bitch, dude, I can't click. I don't want to choose both of them, just Noodle. Noodle's about to starve again. Feed Noodle. Chocobo needs rescue. <sighs> Things are still going well. Um, in case you couldn't tell. Nate, rescue them. Medical emergency. Who? Auto? Blood loss extreme. Look, it's fine. It's getting better. You just need to give it some time, dude. We could give you a blood transfusion, but we don't have any doctors that are alive right now, so... There we go. Uh, undraft. Oh, an advanced component. Cool. Allow everything, including the corpses. Allow, allow... Allow, or actually, you know what? I have this handy button. Allow everything. Chick24 is wandering away. Don't care. Noodle, Noodle is starving again. Rue, I know you just want to sleep, but you gotta f feed your wife. Why is Otto out of bed? Did Nate just, like, stop? <laughs> Bro, that's your lover. <laughs> rescue? Or no, you rescued Chocobo, didn't you? For fuck's sakes. Mm. Hopterjack is fed up with civilization. She realized that wild creatures are always free, so she has decided to leave your faction and live with the animals. 
Bro. <laughs> How are you just going to turn into a wild animal like that? Ah. Uh, okay. Rue? Playing the game of Ur? Nope. Go arrest Optijack. Oh, you need a prisoner bed. That's fine. We can do that. For prisoners. Does Nate have a better chance? He's right there. So, Nate, you can do it. Capture Optijack. Oh, boy. Now who's starving? Chocobo and Otto. Well, Chocobo's feeding themselves. Otto won't feed themselves. Lulu? We're going to have to cancel this bill. <laughs> Rue's researching? No. You need to feed Otto. And then... Finish off Mr. Noodle. Make sure we don't misclick, man. That should not be so close to feed. <laughs> like, <laughs> Wait, did you already feed? Okay, yeah. Must have already fed auto. I still don't understand. Like, what's causing you to not be able to move? Wait, Noodle has a peg leg too? Hm. Uh, it's a mix of being your withdrawal and your pregnancy. That's fair, I guess. All right, if we let the prisoner go. <laughs> are you gonna rejoin since we arrested you? Or are you gonna try to run free again, Optogenic? <laughs> There's no leaving the colony once you're a part of it, man. Um, Rue. When you're done making lovin', release Optijack and probably feed your wife. Independent wild woman. No! So we do have to convert you. Son of a bitch. Wow, so they legit left the faction. We have to convince them to rejoin. Capture. Bruh. <laughs> this was supposed to be our easy game. Or our easy run. All right then, prisoner, convert. Not convert, we wanna... Yeah, it's not convert that we want. We wanna... What? Maybe we do need to convert? I'm confused. I don't know if it's a glitch because apparently stuff is bugged or what, but. You really need to get some Psychite, dude. What's <laughs> that? Hops, Smoke Leaf. But we have Psychite Tea. Can we, like, administer Psychite Tea? Health. Operations, add bill. Administer Psych IT. Uh, auto. Prioritize operation. There we go. <laughs> That's all Noodle needed to get back up on their feet. <laughs> Some drugs. So do we have a warden? We don't. Uh, Optijack was our warden. Good. Um, I guess it's going to have to be Mr. Noodle. Yeah. Mm. 
put on a five. So you'll handle, you'll hunt, and then you'll take care of prisoners. Uh. Oh. I did not mean to generate the planet. That's fine. Go back. Hmm. I'm at a loss, man. <laughs> like, I don't know what to do with this freaking colony, man. Now that we have Psych IT, everybody should be getting in a better mood. So there's that, at least. Like, they shouldn't be as pissy as much anymore. But having that psychic drone is going to make things rough, at the very least. Ah. At least we have plenty of food. <laughs> like, we shouldn't have any problems with food, basically, ever. Still dealing with power problems, though. I thought with it being warmer out, we wouldn't have to worry about the power as much, but... I guess that was wrong. With as warm as it is, we can just straight turn off all of those. That'll save some power, because even when they're not running, they still use a little bit of power. That should help. I mean, it's almost 100 degrees outside. Like, we don't, we don't need heaters running anymore. Hopter Jack was our builder, too. Oh, good. Heat wave. Can we... Can't somebody do... Yeah, convert. Hopter Jack's gone berserk. We just came in to try to feed you, dude. <laughs> like, really? Chocobo, where's your weapon at, my guy? That's not your weapon. Is it down here? Where'd you drop your weapon at? It's a cute guinea pig. Where's the last place he went down at? I'm blind. I'm not seeing his weapon at all. Alright, well... Pato doesn't have his weapon either. Where'd all the weapons go? I mean, it's just from, like, when people randomly have gotten knocked down. Oh god, all of our animals are gonna freaking thirst to death. Um, Brosive. I know I'm blind, but like, holy hell. I'm not seeing any weapons. I'm not seeing any anything. We have this stockpile set up, so weapons should all be going over here, right? Noodle, thanks so much for the five bits, love. Um, Priority critical, all weapons, yeah. And this one's just like normal priority or something, right? Yeah, normal. Hmm. Hmm. Are you going to give up or are you going to actually break out? You actually broke out, you son of a bitch. prisoners grab everyone well, I don't actually want to like attack him just grab everyone and arrest no okay rue what 
Okay, never mind. Everybody attack object. Did he die? No, he's still alive. Okay. Um, who's over here? Rue. Arrest. How much of a heat wave are we talking about? 110 degrees is our freezer. It's it's holding up. <laughs> Not by much, but it is frozen still. You're still a wild woman. Rue, I want you to convert. Must target a non-wild human. What about for conversion ritual? Ew. Hmm. Council? Oh, tame. You have to tame the wild person. Okay. That's how that works. I gotcha. I mean, that makes sense. They're basically a wild animal right now. Manhunting pack of iguanas. Oh, that's a bunch of them. That's a bunch of them. And of course, half our people don't have weapons, because I don't know where the hell they went. Alright, uh... Grab everyone. Come over here. Choke a bow, though. Equip the recurve bow, and then come over here. Nate and Rue. Nice. All right. Manhunter pack dealt with. Brawler has ranged weapon. I know, but I don't know where his weapon is. Did it get stolen? I don't... I'm legit very confused about this. Okay, well, there's Otto's weapon. The auto pistol. Here's, I guess, Optijax, maybe? You know what? Cancel. Allow. No, yeah, do allow. I do want to build all this crap, but it's going to take forever. And it just makes it harder to see anything. So we're looking for, I think it was a jade knife. Convince this jade knife doesn't exist. I think somebody stole it. Maybe it was like getting close to breaking and so it just rotted away. I mean, that is a possibility. Oh, shoot. Optijack was also our manager. Um, Lulu can manage. They suck at it, but whatever. Chugbo has heat stroke. Go inside, my guy. <laughs> Seek safe temperature. Lulu, when you're done washing, manage. That's going to take a minute. <laughs> Turns out having a kid do all the, the math and stuff for figuring out what needs done in the colony may not have been the best idea, but look, somebody's got to do it. And they get to spend quality time with dad there. There we go. So now, yeah, I was going to say a bunch of these animals should be marked for offing. 
whenever Noodle wakes up. Chocobo, if you have to use a ranged weapon, might as well use one that's a little bit better. Until we figure out what the hell happened to your knife. Drinking Saitai tea, what are you doing next? You're hauling and then slaughtering some animals? Okay. When you're done slaughtering some animals, <laughs> try... Wait, you're going to sleep? You just woke up! I mean, I guess you're pregnant. I'll give you that. Try to tame Optogen. <laughs> Wait, what? No. Try to tame Optijack. Oh, they went to sleep. Oh, I hate you all. Food's good. Baby food's good. Pemmican's good. Kibble's good. Everything's going okay besides everybody's in a really shitty mood. we like wake him up what if we deliver him food because i assume that if we feed them food that'll wake him up right hey yeah okay tame Attending marriage ceremony. Taming Optijack? Attending marriage ceremony, taming Optijack. What? Interacted too recently, so that didn't work, sadly. Hmm. Handler, anyone. That's just our new pet, you know? Wait, why do one of the chicks burn to death? Why are we not beating the fire out? Oh, because... Oh, Noodle and Rue are get the ones getting married. <laughs> Noodle... <laughs> oh, Noodle was late to their own marriage because they had to try to tame Optijack. Like... A mad wild boar. Hey, nobody go outside for a bit. We didn't miss it. We caught the end of it. Optijack's having a crisis of belief. And now they're in a daze. Things are going well, dude. I mean, look, it was just you two standing next to each other with everyone standing around you. Like, basically like a real marriage, you know? Oh, good. They went to sleep. Oh. <sighs> Independent wild woman. Can we uh, try to tame you again? No. We need someone to get inspired taming. Nate's in labor. Oh, you know what? We need to get a crib for Nate. Where's Nate's room? Here it is. Uh, Build copy. Build copy. Build copy. What was this about a sleep accelerator? We can build sleep accelerators? Because Noodle needs one of those, man. Oh. Does it only work for babies? Oh, no. We're clicked on the wrong thing. There. 
Uh, who's like our next best builder? How did Nate's baby survive? I honestly couldn't tell you. Survive plagues, survive stomach parasites. Like, it's honestly a miracle. Uh, construction. Two, five for Rue. Nine for Nate, but they're kind of in labor. So it looks like Rue. Wait, did that say prioritize skill too low? Okay, so we might have to wait for Nate. Dude, is nobody going to save Nate? Nate's in labor. Take them somewhere, dude. Wait, Nate already had the baby. The baby's just chilling outside. Put the baby somewhere safe. Jesus, man. This colony is not safe for children, dude. What should we name the baby? Rue, when you wake up, at least build the crib. And how's Nate? Are they nice and healthy? Yes. Their titties are very full. But other than that, they're just tired. So that's good. Luis or Louis? I mean, if Nate's still around, they should have the pick, obviously. Um, but if not, then I'm down for it, dude. Boy or girl? Good question. Where is baby? Oh, Otto's dragging it around. Uh, female. Lulu looks cute. Yee. With their red ass eyes. <laughs> Baby here looks angry. We're going to give Nate another minute or two to pop in. If they don't, then yeah. All right, we want to assign this to Baby. Hey, Nate's up. Okay. Nate, do you have enough skill? You do. So when you're done consuming your simple meal. Okay, cool. We got smithing. Uh, machining. Next. Turns out, even though we're not supposed to have to really deal with <laughs> too much BS uh, from, like, fights and stuff like that, we still got to deal with a bunch of BS from, like, fights and stuff like that. <laughs> Wrapped up in my cord again. Bro, I had no idea we had the tech to build sleep accelerators. Bed hunger rate multiplier plus 20%. What? <laughs> I didn't know it was going to make Noodle even more hungry, though. Bro, <laughs> Noodle's never going to get a full night's rest because they freaking have to get up and eat every five minutes. Crazy. Luna! I like Luna. Yeah. I think Luna's gonna be the one, dude. Right. Oh, not Nate. Baby. No, baby. Luna. Uh, last name. What's Nate's last name in game? Bacado? I don't care what Otto's last name is, so. <laughs> Does anyone remember what I just said? Oh, wait, right there. Father. Mother. Bacato. B-E-C-A-T-O. Nickname. I guess just Luna, huh? For the nickname. All right, Noodle. Are you getting ready to have your baby or something? Common side effect of pregnancy represents a rising and falling mood caused by unbalanced hormones. Oh. Okay. So you're just feeling like shit, so you're taking a nap in the hospital? That's fine, honestly. I get that. Sometimes same. Uh, can we... Can 
Bruh, we're not supposed to get raided. I legit could have swore we had raids turned off, dude. Clear allowed area. Uh, actually, I guess expand allowed area. New area. Pawns. Um. And then expand. Have I ever played Horizon Zero Dawn? No, I really want to. And I have it on PlayStation. Uh, I don't have the PC version of it. But that's probably how I'll end up playing it at some point. Um, but I haven't played it yet. I do really want to, though. It looks really, really good. I'm assuming they have some sort of, like, proximity activator. Yeah, right there. So just hopefully they don't walk through here to, like, go hunting or something. Bought it, never touched it, got bored, so I started and uh, it's good, really good. I've heard really, really good things about it. Wait, what? When did we get toxic fallout? <laughs> Bro, we're fucked. <laughs> Legitimately, I think I think we're fucked. I don't even know what to do right now. Our only water source right now is wells. Can we get? We don't have any other way of getting water. Water. Water mill. Oh, dubs bad hygiene. Heating, plumbing, deep well. Deep well needs electric pump, which needs modern bathroom, which needs plumbing. <laughs> There's no way! And we still need the freaking mortars to take care of the mechs that just spawned. Uh, even though the mechs that just spawned, I'm pretty sure have shields. That's a power shell. Shell? Cell? Oh, maybe not. Yeah, okay, never mind. I guess they don't have a shield, so a regular mortar would work. Oh, that's why this is a toxic spewer they spawned with. We're supposed to have raids turned off. Raids aren't supposed to happen. Yet for some godforsaken reason. Um Nate. Um Grab your weapon. Mr. Noodle. You're down right now because you're very pregnant. How much longer? I think you can get up at this point, right? No, you can't walk. Why can't you walk? Uh, health overview. Oh, because you're in withdraw. Again. Rue, give your wife drugs. Uh, health, operations, add bill. Are we out again? We're freaking out again, dude. We have leaves. Nate just hasn't made it. Probably because, you know, he's very pregnant. Toxic buildup. Right, I think we're fucked. Um, well, <laughs> wow, the colony's getting fucked. PS2 collection list. Oh no, don't Google search that. I want to go to it. 
So we're all dead then? I mean, technically no, but there's toxic fallout. We're down a couple fighters. Um, uh, so we're going to have to try and take out these things, because if we don't take them out, then we're screwed. Um, a platform to be determined. E how long to beat? Don't know. True. And you know what? I'll put one vote on it right away. There you go. I put Horizon Zero Dawn on the games to beat list. Major break risk. Yep, everybody's in a shitty ass mood. Guess what? Doesn't matter. Here we go. Wonder if these ones will actually chase us. Get everyone, like... I don't even see, like, a good place to actually do this at. If we just attack the toxic fallout generator, I'm assuming that's going to activate them. Yeah. What if we just run away now, though? Will they chase us down? Because that would make life a lot easier for us if they did. What are you, a scorcher? So the answer to that is no. They will not chase us down. We literally have no choice here. Uh, stay in here. Come. We can't outrange them, actually. So it's probably best, honestly. Just attack. Attack and a hope for the best, man. What is the Scorcher doing? Oh god, I'm legit scared of the Scorcher, dude. Ow, Nate's on fire. Okay, Nate's fine. Nice. Okay, everybody, go inside, get some treatment and stuff. We're gonna have to just take them out, like, one or two at a time. Maybe don't eat on the battlefield, you dumbasses. <laughs> go inside and eat. You're literally being shot at. Oh my god. Who's got lung rot? I don't know. One of the animals. How's everybody doing health wise, though? Just initial toxic buildup. Noodle's fine because they've been inside the whole time. Initial for Nate, minor for Chocobo, initial for Otto, initial for Lulu. Luna's malnourished. Nate, you're fine, right? Death in five hours. Never mind. Otto, resting? No, take care of your wife, dude. Where is your wife? Nate, where are you? Oh, God, Nate never got back inside. Why were you outside? <laughs> Nate's down. Oh, rescue. I think this is pretty much it, dude. I... Screw it. After everybody's healed up, it's almost time. It's actually... I'd normally be getting off, like, right now. But uh, we're just gonna suicide mission it, dude. We're gonna let everybody heal up first. Maybe Noodle will pop out their baby finally or whatever. Um, Chocobo, you're going to get shot at. Ignore the fire. Oh my god. Auto's beating fire out? No. Rescue Chocobo. Clear home area. Not the wall. The wall itself catches fire? Fine, put it out. Otherwise, just ignore it for right now. Uh, Rue? Put out the, the wall. Ooh. 
why do you guys keep walking outside to eat and stuff? <laughs> Stay inside. You're gonna get shot, dude. Otto's like the slowest person in the world. Chocobo's gonna die before they get back to, <laughs> to the bed. Nate died. Of blood loss? I thought he was fine. just got shot in the head and again there goes Rue Noodles catatonic Optijack's gone berserk Otto's down it's all up to you Lulu Take out the toxic generator. <laughs> Lulu's down. A man in black showed up to save the colony. His name is Ur. Can he save the colony? Wait, don't you have a weapon? There we go. Come on, man in black with your... <laughs> Every single pistol you got here. <laughs> Move up a little bit closer. Your aim will be a lot better. There we go. There's one shot. There's two. Let's go, Ur. <laughs> Ur hasn't been hit yet. He's got an old gunshot to his right leg. Is he any good at shooting? He does have some shooting skill. That's good. The base is on fire. Come on, dude. Get out the freaking pikeman, man. He's so close. Okay, he's dead. How is Ur? Death in 16 hours? You gotta run up here where the turrets can't shoot you, my guy. Oh, God. Your right ear was shot off. Okay, you're fine. Get rid of this stupid machine. Oh my god, this is going to take forever. Can I have you melee attack it? Melee attack. Auto died. Rue died. Come on, dude. Get this stupid thing down. We're fucked, pretty much. And... Toxic Fallout over. Okay, Ur, get out of there. Uh, on your way, could you maybe actually, like, rescue Lulu? Oh, God. <laughs> Luna's still alive, technically. Luna's one of the only people alive. Oh, Ur's down. Well, we technically have Noodle until they starve to death uh, because they can't move. Chocobo is okay, kind of. Oh, never mind. Chocobo can't walk. Um, so unless somebody miraculously heals themselves, Lulu's dead. Sorry. Uh, it's a short life, but... Hopefully a good one while it lasted. Uh, Chocobo's dead, by the way. Um, so... Uh, Ur, Ur, Ur did die. Uh, he's not just down. He's he's dead. Uh, so, I mean, look. Noodle, if you just decided to crawl your way over to some food, you could live. 
Um, but sadly, you refuse to just crawl your way over to the kitchen to get some food. So I think you're going to die. And uh, Luna's probably going to die too because there's nobody here to feed her. Oh, and the pen animals are hungry too. Not that anybody cares about that right now. I... I seriously thought we had all the raids turned off. I guess I didn't realize that, like, mech raids were still a thing. <laughs> we're going to come back to RimWorld one of these days. And uh, maybe whenever Optijack decides to take a break or something, we'll alternate between, most likely it looks like at this point, Bethesda Games and uh, RimWorld or something. I still want to do a late game run <laughs> of this fucking game. This was supposed to be that chance. But, uh, yeah, we, had, we hadn't turned off mechs, I guess. And our gameplay, modify. Yeah, we are playing on, like, there's a bunch of different modes, but the slightly harder mode. But, like, since I didn't think raids were going to be a thing, I built, like, no defenses, man. <laughs> We didn't have, like, any any gun tech or turret tech or mortars or anything like that to defend ourselves. So once our wealth started to build up and to the point to where mechs started dropping on us, we were just kind of fucked at that point, man. Which, I guess, fair. Pan animals are starving. I mean, there's a lot of bones. Just eat the bones. Oh, there goes Luna. Malnourished. And there goes Noodle. That's it. That's the end of it. So I guess in two weeks, man, we're going to start playing some Bethesda games. Or whatever ends up winning the vote. But as of right now, Bethesda games are in the lead. So uh, that could change, of course. Assuming it is Bethesda, we'll probably... I originally, when I first planned on doing, like, the challenge runs on Bethesda games, I wanted to do all of the mainline Elder Scrolls games. Uh, next Friday is going to be uh, uh, grounded with OptiJack because we're going to swap out every other week. Um, we're going to do one thing with OptiJack and then, or just with friends in general, uh, but, like, the, the strategy games or whatever. And then we're going to do the other week, the Bethesda stuff, every other week switching. Um, but, yeah, originally I had planned on doing all the mainline Elder Scrolls games. And all of the mainline Fallout games. Um, but honestly, like... Yes, so that's that's the thing. Give me a second to explain here. Uh, but I don't know. We might... So there's Skyrim, Morrowind Oblivion. Those are all new enough, right? And then there's Fallout 3, New Vegas, and 4. So that's three of each. But there's also Fallout 1 and 2, which I enjoy. It's not everybody's cup of tea, but I enjoy those ones at least. Um... And then there's also the first two Elder Scrolls games. So technically, there's like five of each. Uh, so I'm going to leave it up to you guys. Assuming that it's Bethesda games, should we do those older Fallout and, and Elder Scrolls games or just leave those ones out? Because it'll still be three and three if we leave them out, which would be fine. And the reason that's important, because after we beat the games, uh, probably mostly focusing on the, I don't know. I, I say mostly focusing on the main story, but I'm terrible at doing that. So I guess we'll see. Uh, but after we do that, I want to do challenge runs of them is like the actual goal where there's permadeath. If we die, we're dead. And in every game, I'll either use mods it, or the official uh, survival mode. Um, so like if there is an official survival mode, like with New Vegas, Skyrim, uh, Fallout 4, I'll use that. If not, I'll use mods. If neither one of those are available, then uh, we'll put our own rules in place to make it survival-esque. And on top of that, um, I'm going to have limited healing and saving and stuff like that. We'll still be allowed to quick save because Bethesda games are known to crash, but we won't be allowed to reload those quick saves unless we crash. Um, healing can only be done at places of rest. Um, so like no healing mid battle, unless we have something that automatically heals for us. Uh, that's fine because the idea being, if you're in the middle of fighting, 
a, uh, a dragon in Skyrim or something like that, you're not going to just start pulling out potions and chugging them down left and right, right? Like, that's ridiculous. Or or shooting yourself up with stim packs and fall out. Like, it's just, <laughs> bruh. <laughs> I, I've always found that a little bit ridiculous. So, so only healing at places of rest. Um, only saving at places of rest for, for full saves, etc. Like, uh, stuff like that. <laughs> the proper way is to stuff yourself on potatoes. Oh, that's the other thing. Um, we will be, if survival mode's a thing that requires eating and drinking, awesome. If not, we will be requiring ourselves to eat and drink at least three meals a day and some amount of liquid. Um, and again, that we can technically do anywhere, but only in safe areas. Uh, also, fast travel, unless it's... Uh, fast travel would be turned off. Um, and in all cases, unless like in Skyrim, how you can take the carts to go from place to place, that's fine. Or in, I think it's Fallout 4, you can get, like, the Vertibird or whatever that takes you around eventually. That's fine. Um, but otherwise, we'll actually have to run everywhere. So it's like survival mode plus kind of deal. Uh, my original plan was to do it all on the hardest difficulty every game, because that's generally how I play Bethesda games. But legendary mode on Skyrim is bullshit. <laughs> um, especially whenever you're trying to play a mage. Uh, there's just, the enemies are way too tanky to be fun. Am I nuts? A little bit. There's a guy out there, many a true nerd, love, love his, uh, YouTube series. Check him out sometime. That plays the, uh, has played through Fallout 3, New Vegas, and 4, uh, with one health bar. No healing at all throughout the entire game. Uh, and that includes radiation. So, like, you think I'm nuts. That guy's nuts. Um, I'm doing an easier version of what he's doing, honestly. <laughs> I'm just doing something more roleplay-esque, I guess. Um, but yeah, so harder difficulty, survival mode, extra survival rules on top of that. Realism rules, I guess we could call it. That's what we'll be doing for the Bethesda games. And then uh, once we beat them all, though, then if we still want to continue playing them is when we'll start doing the challenge runs of them. Um, so we'll start with, say, Fallout 3 Challenge Run. If we die, we'll go to Morrowind. And then if we die there, we'll go to Fallout New Vegas. If we die there, to Oblivion. And then to Fallout 4, and then to Skyrim. So just kind of like swapping back and forth. Like... Maybe leave them out. Graphics are already shit enough. I'm not sure they'd do well on Twitch. Yeah, true. There are some people that uh, are really into, like, those classic games. I had a, a couple different people stop in a few times because I used to stream them before I took streaming seriously, like, with any sort of schedule. Um, so, like, people did stop in and, like, stop and talk and give tips and things like that, which, thank God, because uh, the very first Elder Scrolls, Elder Scrolls Arena, I would have been completely lost in without the help of, uh, I don't remember the viewer's name. But dude, that that dude gave me major pointers. I would have been fucked without him. So shout out to that guy. Um, but yeah, like there are people that that do enjoy them, and there are remakes in the works. Uh, the Elder Scrolls Two has a remake in Unity. It still has you know pretty shit graphics, but more quality of life stuff. And there's a remake being worked on for a while of Elder Scrolls One. It's just uh, not ready for like release yet. Um, so yeah, and then I'm considering throwing Fallout 76 in there somewhere, but I don't know. I, I don't know how that will work, so I'm leaving it out for now. But anyways, that's if Bethesda gets picked, that's how that's all gonna work. If Nintendo gets picked, we'll probably just play through. Nin or yeah, we'll probably just play through Nintendo games. You know, for Pokemon games, since I've played those a million times, Nuzlocks. For Mario games, just normal. Maybe some Mario ROM hacks or something like that as well. Um, Zelda games again, probably just just normal stuff, but on like a harder difficulty or whatever if available. Uh, and then speed runs, Mario, Zelda, Deepest Sword. Uh, maybe we could try our hand at like Skyrim speed running or something. I don't know. Those always look kind of fun. But yeah, that's to be determined, I guess. Anyways, though, uh, thanks for joining me while I murdered a colony of people. Well, you guys technically, I guess. <laughs> Sorry about that. It happens sometimes. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. So today's Friday, so the next couple of days, or well, tomorrow I'll be off. Sunday we'll be back playing some more PS2 stuff, hopefully. And then, uh, yeah, we'll just go from there. Anyways, guys, thank you again 
Have a good night, everyone. And as always, be kind to each other. Bye-bye, y'all. Blocking the path. I, mean, I guess maybe there was a long way around. Maybe you're meant to go that way. If you're not fucking Naruto. <laughs> Tree felling village. Please and thank you. Can I just knock down the city gate too? With my, with my Rasengan? That'll just be my answer to everything. Just completely fucking destroy it. Oh, I got to this. is tree felling village. There's a cave where you can mine high quality crystals. Wow. Clash with the black shadow. The bond between parent and child. That's a hell of a title card. <laughs> no like special background or anything, just generic text. I like it. So do I. Let's go check it out.